going on? It's your boy Cartoon here with Cartoon Review. We'll review anything that a consumer could buy. Today we're going to be talking about my journey being a YouTuber, especially a tech YouTuber. Stay tuned. <laughs> Alright, it's a very complicated, controversial, whatever you want to say about being a YouTuber. Me personally, I've been in the YouTube, being a YouTuber for a year and a half, I would say right now. And it ain't how it's supposed to be, I think. It's a lot of grinding. It's a lot of sleepless nights doubting yourself um just let's go let's, let me break it down for you first of all to be a youtuber you need a certain amount of equipment and you might have a like I, i'm using my phone my s21 ultra mic computer you could do it on your phone cool but being a tech youtuber you need to be up to date with the latest and greatest tech that you can review so people could watch it and you trying to monetize yourself you get the 4000 hours and then the 1000 subscriber i have a lot of sleepless nights because when i make a video and I put my heart into it. I do everything that I can to the best of my ability. And I feel confident like, yo, I'm going to hit it. This one is going to go to the moon. And you come to find out that you only got like 10 or 15 views. It really, really hurts. You try to do other things like promoting it, sharing it, putting it in places that you think is gonna get any kind of traction and it doesn't is 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 kind of discouraging like you you trying your best to do something pretty cool and not to get the views that you expect it really it really makes anybody doubt themselves especially trying to get your hands on product Man, if you don't have if you don't have a constantly money flow like to keep up with it, man, you could go broke quick. So I started creating different videos, try to be a little budget, this down a third. Yes, it do some kind of numbers, but it's just not enough from that video to get other things. Especially when you reach out to these companies, these companies are like, nah, man, we're not going to mess with you. You're too low. And I'm like, listen, just give me the opportunity. Let me do something. Let me help me help me help you, even though it might be a little bit, but you're helping me. I'm reaching out for you. I'm reaching out. It's not like I am getting the, the product and not doing anything with it. Any, anything that any company gives me, I do a video not, I, it won't even take me two or three days. I'll do it like probably in 24 hours. i do the video, throw it out there. But companies not... I mean, I understand because at the end of the day, if you could give one product to one person who has hundreds of thousands, even millions of subscribers, it's totally different than a guy that just have, right now, got like under 700 subscribers. I understand that, but sometimes these companies, I feel like, yo, you know what? Let's give something to the little guy. Let's give something to the newer, to the newer. It's not gonna hurt our, our bottom man. And if he doesn't do what he says he's gonna do, we just don't send him anything else. I wish company could do that, but it is what it is. I understand. Um, it might, I might be a little rant. It's not a rant. It's just, I'm just speaking out. I just got to talk about it. That is the hardest part when you're doing something and you want it to be appreciated the same way you put into it. And it just doesn't, doesn't work. 
I could, like I said, I could make this video and a popular YouTuber, I'm not gonna mention no name, could do the same video. And just because he got the subscriber, he's gonna hit it out of the park. It's the same. It's all. It's gonna be the same video, almost the same. You always, you always try to put your little little sauce into it, but I just feel like being a, a tech YouTuber with no budget. I mean, with a small budget. I'm sorry, with a small budget. I just can't buy four iPhones right now and then buy a pixel, then buy a camera, then buy this, that, and a third, then buy a TV, then buy this. I just can't. I really can't. And it, and that and that's where you start doubting yourself. Like, damn, I'm falling behind. But in all reality, you're not really falling behind. You just don't have the funds to do it. You just, the way I look at it right now is I'm just doing videos just to, Whatever I have to show, I give my opinions and just let the world see it. If they enjoy it, they will subscribe to my channel. They will like it. They will they will they will do everything possible to let other people know, hey, there's a new there's a new cat in town. Most times I just be like, you know what? F this. I fall back for a week, two weeks, maybe a month. And then I get the bug back again. That's something that I got to overcome. And little by little, I'm overcoming because it's a grind. Some people got it easy. Some people got it hard. The way I look at it, I got it hard. I got to keep grinding, working, putting out dope videos, being, communicate with the community of tech, do more, be out there. If... The way I look right now also, the way I look at it is, if one person is watching my video, that's just of one more person that is enjoying my video. I do a lot of giveaways. I give my own opinion. It's, 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 it's pretty, it's, it's a tough gig. I know if I keep working, it's gonna be there. I have a lot of people on Twitter and Instagram showing me love. That's the motivation that I have, especially when my kids be like, yo, or my nieces and nephew be like, yo, I just seen your video like 15 times. I like, yo, thank you, man. I appreciate it. And they sometimes know word by word my video, which is dope. That's motivation now that I'm having to make more videos to like be like, you know what? If you don't have it, you don't have it. So what? Next time around, you might have it. Or next time around, or maybe one day I wake up and I get an email from Google, Sony, anybody, and be like, yo, send me, give me your address, give me your info, I'm gonna send you something, I'm gonna send you a care package. I'll definitely appreciate it. But I know it's gonna take, it's gonna be a lot of hard work, a lot of more sleeping nights, but I just can't let that stop me from being great. Anybody that is trying to get in this tech YouTube, it's a lot of work a lot of work uh, and most importantly being consistent i haven't i'll be honest i'll be the number one I, I haven't been consistent i haven't been and that might be also my little downfall why my numbers is not up there 90 percent is my fault if i do consistent and i start just whatever i have i could talk about it and every news that come out i talk about it i know my my numbers is gonna go up and I'm gonna give it a try. I'm definitely gonna try that. Even if I don't have a product in my hand, I'm gonna talk about it. Because there's a thousand opinions. With mine, with, with my opinion would be a thousand and one. So I might be the factor that taught, that pushed you towards a product that you was you was considering. You just look in different opinions. I might be the one. And that would be just an extra subscriber, extra fan, an extra supporter to push me to greatness. I just wanted to sit down and talk. Just talk. I hope y'all listen. I ain't, I'm not going to cut nothing up. It's going to be straight up. All I ask for is give me an opportunity. Give me a chance. Um, I might sound like I'm begging, but sometimes I don't, you don't, YouTube, you don't, you can't, you really, you really just got to 
do you, man. Go do me. And I feel like if you give me an opportunity, you're definitely going to enjoy yourself with my channel. I have a lot of dope content. Yeah, it's not up there, but it will be soon up there. I'm, I'm pretty sure about that. All I ask for y'all is like this video, subscribe to my channel. If y'all want to leave anything down below in the comment below, y'all welcome to. It's a boy cartoon. Peace. Uh.